All my latest invention needs now is a little fine tuning. <laughs> huh? Huh? Ooh. Huh? Whoa! You clumsy klotzes! You hapless hippopotami! Uh, Tony, this is really hard! Hard? <laughs> you know what's hard? Being a genius surrounded by idiots! Seriously, how can we play football when we can't stay on our feet? Yeah, Tony, I just feel kind of out of control. That's it! My device will work. I just need a test subject who can handle being out of control. Nope. <laughs> but no. Pretty close, but, uh, aha! We have a winner! And by winner, I mean loser! <laughs> Super Sentence! Boys are on top form. Take the rest of the day off. Thanks, Coach. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> All right. See you back here on Monday. Wow, guys, wasn't that like the hottest you've ever got at practice? Yeah, even my sweat is sweaty. A Zergelzer! It would be nice to cool off. Oh, <laughs> imagine someone had a new swimming pool. With waterfall feature, infinity edge, and enclosed spiral water slide? That's the one. I'll race you guys there. Not so fast. <laughs> Okay, I'll let my limited edition Elmata coin decide. Heads, we swim. Ponytails, you lose. Heads. Oh, I'll be the pool party. Right, hey, Bruno, you miss me? Home time. <laughs> hey, watch it! Are you okay? Uh, Did they hurt you? <laughs> Radical. Yo, it's Croco Stylin'. <laughs> Seriously, Shakes? Crocky the smile dial I borrowed it from Klaus. Had it since I was five. <laughs> Looks like you haven't ridden it since then either. Yeah, I never progressed past beginner, so I switched to two wheels. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Instead of <laughs> dissing my board, how about teaching me some moves? Of course I could show you some gnarly tricks. But... Only if you can keep up! Yes! <laughs> Shove it! Carving! Kickflip! Ghost Holly! Into grind! Hydrant Stall! First time! I wouldn't catch up, huh? <gasps> Not bad, Shakes, but we gotta go back to the basics. And for that, there's no place better than the gnarly Ollie Skate Shop. Huh, an original Crocky Short Cruiser. Gnarly. Really? <laughs> no. I tried to tell you, Shakes. So. Let's get him a new deck, some decent trucks, 52 mil wheels. And the rest of the Gromit starter kit? Gromit? Come on, tell me I'm past Gromit. Uh, hold that thought. Mr. Shaw. This is he. Whoa, that's actually pretty cool. The what? The Los Angeles Academy of Magnetic Electrotechnology. We need you to help us develop a new electromagnetic shoe. <laughs> Nah, dude, I'm not the shoe endorsement guy. Seriously, you're the only person with the rad bad skill combo we need. Skateboarding and, uh, uh... uh skateboarding and... Uh, just skateboarding. So, what about it? Deck, trucks, beginner wheels, helmet pads, and... Shove It magazine. No way! That's impossible! Look, dude, if you want to pass on skateboarding's most audacious breakthrough since the wheel, I guess we could call Liquido. 
Gotta rain check on that lesson, Shakes, dude. But, uh, check out Chubbett's triple page spread on moves every grummet should know. I'm in. Great! <laughs> it's gonna be the gnarliest thing I've ever done! May I? Get enough of this pool. Sure, but what about the old pool? Drained it. I'm deciding whether to turn it into a parking garage or fill it with Elmata coins so I can swim in them. Fill it with Elmata coins? I thought you said they were limited edition. There it is. <laughs> a parking garage. Hey, Shakes, Ma. Hey, you Shakes. join us. Oh, oh, brother, are you gonna skate? Or be shot out of a cannon. <laughs> Very funny. With Northshaw. Oh, he had to head out of town. Something about the gnarliest thing he's ever done. <laughs> Classic Northshaw. I bet it's a hydrofoil surf boat. Now, now, gotta be stratospheric base jumping. Ha! It's stratos... Stratos... The second one. <laughs> <laughs> Moves every grommet should know. Start with the basics. Ugh, boring. Whoa. Mr. Shaw, welcome to the Los Angeles Academy of Magnetic Electrotechnology. Thanks. You do know that spells lame, right? Yeah. And I don't mean to bust your chops, but did you fly me all the way out to Los Angeles just to ride a half pipe? Ahem. <clears throat> Yanking my chain. Wheels free technology. The next level of skateboarding is here. Actually, not quite yet, Mr. Shaw. The Academy has failed to fine tune the maglev ratio mm -hmm. due to trial subjects' inability to maintain equal weight distribution. <laughs> we need a skater with the radical skills to balance how the magnets in the surface help control the metal in the shoe. Well, then I'm your guy. Let's do this. Time to shred. Uh -huh. oh! 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 Maybe you should call a Quido. Actually, my recalibration seems to have worked. You should be able to do it now. I don't think I can take another fall. I've got a game against Technicali next week. Huh? It should be working now, Mr. Shaw. First time bull rider, start with a low arc. Yeah! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo! Dude! One last thing. All this gnarly stuff is highly classified. Sign here. <laughs> Your secret's safe with me! And that's the final whistle, sealing a massive upset for the home team at the hub. I've never seen Technicali move with such grace and speed. Neither has Scar on that. That is what Technicali did to Invincible United in LA this week. And if the boys in yellow beat us, we lose our place at the top of the table. All right, coach, what's the plan? How do we beat them? I've prepared some intensive training for you. We work on speed, passing, and communication. Testing thermal vision goggles for night skiing. Give it a break. I even signed a non-disclosure agreement. What, what, what? Leave him alone, guys. He's had enough of our constant questions. Is it an anti-gravity chamber? A spider silk wingsuit? Dudes, I'm not saying anything. Not what, not who, and not where. We'll soon be touching down at LAX. Welcome to Los Angeles, Super Strikers. And welcome back, Mr. Shaw. Not where, huh? Just stop asking questions, oh. all right? You'll have plenty of time for guessing games at the hotel. 
because you're all on lockdown. Ah, come but on. But we're in oh, LA. So. No thanks, got my own wheels, dude! Exactly. Ugh! Now you're following me around? Nah. I'm just here for my skateboard lesson. Yeah, right. Sheesh. I bet you could fit an indoor skydiving wind tunnel in this warehouse. Nice try, dude. Or even a fake mountain for base jumping? I ain't biting. How about hey. a... Hey! Yep, that's a positive ID. Come on, let's get him! Time for that lesson, Shakes, dude. <laughs> First up, it's the luge! Just like you said, one with a mop of hair, and the other... Hmm, you're right. I don't think there is a name for that. Skating is not a crime, officers! It's for you. Get back to the hotel right now! Pop, shove it into a 50-50 grind with a late flip on the landing. Yeah. Sick move. Telling everyone about the warehouse? Jerk move. Sorry, North. I thought giving them more info would calm them down. But it only made us want to know more. And into a wave pool for kiteboarding? Spider silk wing suits? A hot air balloon set free. <clears throat> Maybe it's a massive, high-tech distraction before an important game. Yeah, yeah, Sorry, right, coach. coach yeah. Technically are on form. But with your speed and agility, you can close down their passing options. <laughs> with our speed and agility? There's no way they can stop us! Sorry we ever doubted you, Tony. Your new technique's a total game changer for us. All right, all right. Now get out there and show them what you got! <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and by what you got, I mean what I've given you. <laughs> This isn't so hard. Yeah, how could Invincible Unite and lose to these guys? Yeah, <laughs> now, to me! Crack! What? It's John J. Johnson Jr. like a bolt of blue lightning. Whoa, that kind of looked like a shove it. Pfft, too much skating, North Shaw. Huh? Ollie? <laughs> Kickflip! <laughs> 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 First half is almost over. Eh? 
understand that nothing can stop these fleet-footed men in blue and yellow. Dude, what have I done? O okay, dudes, I'm ready to tell you about, you know, the thing. What? Really? Now? Your timing is whack, brother. Was it the spider silk wingsuit? Gotta be the amphibious jet ski. Enough! I'm settling this with a flip. <laughs> the truth is, I wasn't snow kiting, wingsuiting, highlighting anything. I was asked to help calibrate a wheels free half pipe. A skateboard ramp with no skateboard? Using magnets and metal shoes? Ooh. So that's what was in the warehouse. I was so close. No way. Hey, North, any chance we could try it out? Yeah, where's the skate ramp now? Oh. Yeah, it's right here. It's the hub. Who did you say you helped? Some guy who said he was running a tech startup, okay? A technically startup? You helped our opposition develop technology that allows him to move like ghosts? Are what you the hell? Hell? We're getting thrashed because of you? Sorry, dudes. I can't believe I got suckered in like that. Hey, it only happened because you're such a ripping footballer and skater. Hmm. If only you had metal boots, North. Hey, no matter, dude, how many of those coins do you have? Only the one, North. They're sold out. Obvi. El Matador. <laughs> Special edition El Mata coins, anyone? <laughs> Only one million ever made. Oh, right. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, the grotesque injustice. Nope. This is how the Grom and I... Huh? Grom? Okay, Intermediate Skater and I are going to serve justice to Technicali. And we're back for the second half. Let's hope Super Strikers have a new strategy. Super League Disciplinary Board. Yes, I'd like to report a pitch with some irregularities. Super Strikers are defending in numbers while Shakes pushes up with a new strike partner. North Shaw? Highly unorthodox, Brenda. But an orthodox could be just what Super Striker need. <laughs> Are we? Oh. 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 I've got you, dude. We can do this. Uh. <laughs> Football now from both teams. What? How did they get metal boots? Hmm, no matter. Uh, uh, uh. North Shaw just gives it away. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and he steals it right back. <laughs> Finally, Super Strikers are pulling off some epic moves. Ball has gone from graceful to disgraceful. Huh? Oh, 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 oh. Too much maglev power shakes, dude. Let's lose some coins. Way ahead of you. Whoa! Intermediate, no more shakes, dude. Coach, only a regular thing we found is your boys filled their shoes with coins. Highly unusual, but not illegal. Pool party at my place? 
<laughs> Ponytails it is. That coin was in Shake's shoe. <laughs> I thought I told you to burn the infected ones. Nah, you keep them all. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> they smell like feet. Get ready for practice. But Tony, we never practice just after a game. <laughs> <laughs> Please, put us down. Why? This is the closest you fools will ever get to being on top in the Super League. Uh -huh. Ah, changed my mind. <laughs> Del Aqua to the floating stadium. Come in, floating stadium. Yeah, we read you, boss. Loud and clear. Nothing to report down here. I'm coming back. No, wait! Guys, it's so rad! It says here the Austronesian people built it over a thousand years ago. Shakes, dude, I was amped for our trip to East Malaysia. Yeah, pretty cool place to anchor the floating stadium. But they have to listen to you riff on about these ruins all the way from Strikerland and get this. The ruins slipped onto the Pacific seabed during a massive earthquake. Make it stop! And now it's in a dry dome, so archaeologists can research it. Maybe we can convince Del Aqua to take us down there. Huh? Forget the lost legend shakes and focus on Super Striker's own living legend, El Matador! <clears throat> hey, even legends can have a one-off bad game. <sighs> Awkward. Fine. Three one-off bad games in a row. But my luck is about to change. <sighs> Super Strikers! Some say a bird pooping on you is good luck. Really? Your problem has nothing to do with luck, El Meta Dude. Oh, please. Against Technicali, I laced my boots up using my Tuesday configuration. No wonder I played badly. Then, during the Cosmos game, I found out Ninja bought the same Lamborghini as me. No! no! You expect me to be able to concentrate on... Oh, yeah! Whoa! What is that, Ma? A whale farting, maybe? No, that's the air from the dome. They purge it when oxygen levels get too low. Then suck fresh air back down there. So our team of archaeologists can continue unlocking the secrets of the ruins. Coach Del Aqua? Ahoy there! <laughs> Let's get you settled in. So, what were the ruins built for? It's an amphitheater. Public meetings, perhaps? Mm. Celebrations? Entertainment? And how long can someone stay down there at a time? Only 30 minutes before the dome floods and the air automatically purges. Whoa! The moon pool room. Uh, that's right. It's the base of our ruins operation. That's where you launch the aquapods from. Simon to the moon pool room, Simon to the moon pool room. A self decompressing, solar powered, max depth 200 meters, right? Wow. You really do know your stuff, Shakes. Yeah, all thanks to the nerd manual. Good old National Aquatic. Every last detail, hey? So. Any chance we get to go down there? What does it say in your manual? Uh, archaeologists only? We must do all we can to preserve such a precious archaeological site. That's why we have Simon here. What's up, Mr. Del Aqua, sir? Simon is in charge of Moonpool security today. But I was hoping to watch the game. Oh, you can still watch the game. Match day at the floating stadium. Oh, so close to the action, but so far. Yeah. I know how you feel. What a spectacular setting for this Super League doubleheader, Mac. Indeed, Brenda. Off the coast of East Malaysia and above mysterious ruins. Get me the ball, guys. I'm feeling lucky. Yes! El Matador sets his sights on the Hydra goal. Lá. 
Dog. What do you mean? The Monty Verge are breaking my dry spell, and Hydra come up with some impenetrable defense. Come on, El Matador. Enough with the excuses. The only person responsible for your form is you. Hydra take the first encounter by only a narrow margin. And despite being surrounded by water, El Matador's drought continues. Can this day just end, please? Yeah, easier said than done. This is crazy. Delacqua may be at the forefront of research at sea. Yeah, but he sure ain't at the forefront of comfort at sea. Guys, please, we need to be rested for practice tomorrow. Don't worry, Captain. I've been reading up on the science of sleep. Hit yeah, what yet, you got? Please. Method one, sleep in your socks. Research shows warm feet mean better sleep. <sighs> I guess it's worth a shot. Wow, Klaus, your sleep science actually works. Yep, I feel good as new. What did I tell you guys? Vlog, vlog. Okay, okay, Block, we try something different tonight, yeah? Right. I have three ways to get us some goals against Hydra. Over the top. Come on, Shakes. Run it the in. nerd manual isn't going to help us beat Hydra, <laughs> okay? But first up, we're going to create space in the middle by using Shakes and El Matador as decoys. <gasps> Decoys? But then how I... How do you break your dry spell? Your dry spell is our dry spell. We break it together. Me? A decoy? No, I'm a glorious goal getter, a stylish sharpshooter. I am not a decoy. Huh? Heads up, sleepyhead. <laughs> Sorry, North dude. Water, perhaps? Whoa, <laughs> what a loser. Can't score any goals. Birds poop on me. At least I still have my glorious hair. Oh. Players in the Nerd Dome? <laughs> <coughs> Guys, I, I think I know how Hydra are stopping me from scoring goals. Let me guess. You forgot to wear your lucky underpants? You put your boots on the wrong feet? Is it because it's full moon or something? No, no, no. Guys, listen. El Matador. Change your clothes and your attitude or you're on the bench tomorrow. Method two, listening to soothing sounds will put you right to sleep. Huh, makes me want to go surfing. Makes me want to go to the toilet. Hey, anyone seen my National Aquatic? Oh, shut up, everybody, and go to sleep, please! So, tomorrow we can implement our team-oriented strategy against Hydra. <laughs> Archaeologists only, my butt. Okay, so I grab a submarine thingy, zip down to the door. Ah! Shut, Shut up! up! Why the sudden interest in the nerd dome? I uh, discovered a new sleep technique. Reading about boring old ruins. <gasps> okay, confession. Doodling helps me sleep. It's match day at the luxurious Cosmos universe. Can the home team outmaneuver Ion Tank's brute force and tactics? Uh, mm -hmm. Get out of the pod, El Matador. No shakes. I figured out how Hydra beat us. 
So get out of the pod and we can talk about it. The reason their defense is so good is because they've been training down there. Wow, that is a crazy excuse for playing badly. Even by your standards. It's not an excuse, Chicks. You heard Delacqua. Only archaeologists are allowed in the dome. That's all lies. Anyone can go down there. <laughs> with this crazy idea. When I fell into the water, I saw Hydra players in the dome. You're telling me Delacqua has intentionally misled the whole world so he can use an ancient Austronesian ruin as a training pitch? Yeah, except it's more of an ancient Austronesian training machine. Whoa. of oxygen. You have 15 minutes of oxygen. Only 15 minutes? Good thing we didn't bring the whole team down, right? Whoa! <laughs> You're right. I know. Looks like Del Aqua didn't tell National Aquatic everything. And a goal post! Field markings and defenders and soccer balls. How about we do some research of our own? We figure out a way past these stones. We figure out how to beat Hydra. And I break my gold drought once and for all. Do the honors. It will be my pleasure. One minute of oxygen. Okay, time to get out of here. Come on, Chase. We've almost got it. <laughs> huh? Initiating air purge. <laughs> yeah, we need to get out of here now. <laughs> <laughs> Chase, please tell me you know what to do. I haven't finished reading. <laughs> 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 I guess that's the first truly aquatic, national aquatic! A dream! Oh, that's all! Dude, get up! We overslept! Hey, looks like method two worked a charm! Tonight, method three! <laughs> Research shows having a caregiver watching over you makes you sleep easier. Listen up, boys. Tonight we sleep. <gasps> Hi, coach. Bye, coach. You two have some explaining to do. You remember the plan, right? Yeah, I know what to do. And there's these crazy stone circles that move back and forth. But for real, they're like actually defenders. And it's kind of like playing against Hydra, but- Whoa, 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 El Matador. And you, Shakes? What did you see down there? Well, the dome purged as I arrived, but it just looked like beautiful ruins to me. What? So you only went down there to save El Matador's hide? Yeah, I was scared he'd get stuck. Oh, Shakes, you're such a hero. Seems your attitude hasn't changed at all, El Matador. You know the deal. Ah, oh, the bench? Please, coach, not the bench! Great performance, El Matador. Next step, convince Coach. Match day at the Floating 
stadium. <sighs> and El Matador is on the bench. Simon, why not watch this game for real? Really, Coach Delacqua? Yes. I think our little security threat has been eliminated. El Matador's on the bench, and his body language speaks volumes, Mac. Looks to me like it's still saying, dry spell. Okay, boys, the decoy. Okay, over the top. Right, run it in. <laughs> so, you were right about Hydra modeling their defense on the ruins. I know. But, Shakes, you said we that... We couldn't let Delacqua know what we saw in the dome, Coach. And we needed me on the bench. Let me guess. So you can go down there and figure out a way through the stones. Yeah, but won't Delacqua notice if El Matadude's not there in the second half? Klaus has that covered. Yeah. Uh, I do? <laughs> Hydra have fended off every Super Striker's attack so far. The coach is sticking to his game plan. El Matador is still on the bench. Aye, and his body language is even worse than it was in the first half. Seems the once great striker <laughs> has given up on breaking his dry spell. You have 30 minutes of oxygen. Strikers build the pressure by pushing players forward. But the higher the pressure, the quicker the release. Super Strikers rush back to defend. No! Oh, it's too late! No! No! Yeah, no kidding. I can almost smell the whale fart. <laughs> Correction. Huh? You have 30 seconds of oxygen. One minute divided by you. Please, Mr. Matador, put the pickaxe down, okay? No. Yes. No. Yes. <gasps> no. Initiating air purge. Help! Don't worry. I've done this before. <laughs> Who's finally off the bench, Brenda? Much more positive body language from El Matador. And did your crazy plan work? I have a theory, but there's only one way to test it. Get you the ball. <laughs> Could there be any other way? Last ditch effort from Coach sending on El Matador. I can't imagine moping around on the bench has done anything for his form, Brenda. All you, El Matador. El Matador. Oh, yeah. Come on. What are you waiting for? The perfect moment. Just shoot! And now. We'll be
be sending a few, um, updates through to National Aquatic. Here. Yeah. Soon the secrets of the ruins will be accessible to everyone. Simon? Simon! You're off Moonpole security. Forever! <laughs> Two goals in one game? What a return to port for El Matador! Ah. So, El Matador, you finally broke your dry spell. Sure, but the really important thing is that we won. Just kidding! I broke my dry spell! I broke my dry spell! <laughs> hey, uh, could I borrow your hair dryer? My National Aquatic needs a drying spell. <laughs> yeah. Not funny. I'm really looking forward to getting some rest. Method three, here we go. I don't think that'll be necessary. Turns out the best way to get to sleep is soccer. <laughs> Am I right, Klaus? <laughs> How do you plan to celebrate? In the 25 years since Grimm joined the Super League, we have developed a reputation for showmanship. Yeah! Yeah! So, we can think of no better way to celebrate than by playing Super Strikers. Strikers. Because your first Super League match was against the men in red? Precisely. They beat you 2-0 back then. That would definitely dampen the celebrations. Oh, this time we plan to reverse that scoreline. For Grimm! For Grimm! I love that grim spirit. But who knew? No way. Yeah, not with our three striker formation, right, guys? Totally, Shakes. Just get me the ball and I'll score the goals. Come on. If anyone should get the credit, it's Big Bo. Without his rock solid goalkeeping, we couldn't all play forward. Give me a B for Big Bo. He's the hero of this song. And besides his awesome keeping, he's also very strong. Come on, Big Bo. Aren't you excited to be roomies? Well, I did bring noise-canceling headphones to block out all the humming, singing, and incessant talking. Wow, oh, thanks, Big Bo. Uh, Don't look at me, brother. I've done my time. He once sang me a lullaby all through the night. Klaus, I'm going to need those back. Whoa, so quiet. Perfect for composing new chants. <laughs> give me a B, give me an I, give me a G, B, O. <laughs> Oh, it's you two. You know who is here, in the crowd. As I expected. Well, try not to cause a fuss. <laughs> wow. Do you know who I am? Whatever, I'm still the greatest player Grimm ever had. <laughs> When they see what I do to Big Bo, they'll be begging me to come back. Welcome to the castle, Super Strikers, where we treasure everything grim. From our countless trophies and the Tactinomicon, to our beloved cauldron and the infamous ghost train. Question, does the ghost train contain any actual ghosts? Grim may have a reputation for being haunted, but that's all superstition. Finally. We have the Hall of Heroes. Batbear, the bright. Nogden, the not so bright. Tim, tiny face Dubinsky. And Neville. Neville? His dad paid for the cauldron. But let me tell you about the man who built the cauldron. Legend has it that when the pitch was laid, the cauldron's groundsman came across a stone of peculiar shape. Though many tried, no man could lift it. None but Mislav Markovich. Oh, dude, shredded it up. Awesome. That's going on, Natter. I'm making my own Hall of Heroes. <laughs> 
Where's the stone now? Some say it was lost when the cauldron was revamped. Others say it never existed. Uh, Coach Belmont? It looks like someone's been removed from the Hall of Heroes. Everything even associated with Spike Dawson is strictly banned from these grounds. Woo Heavy! But he deserved it. Yeah. Right, Big Bo? I've moved on. I'm sure Spike has too. This disguise, our fancy dress costume, was useless! Please accept our apology, sir. You can have another one on the house. What else you got? Mort! What you got? <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Dawson. All the other costumes are booked out for the big game. What about... Hey, why are these in the bargain bin? That's the garbage bin. Ah! Here I am with the perfect plan to help Grim beat Super Strikers, but I can't get my message to Big Bo because my only way past security is a pink bunny suit! Why don't you just call him? Huh, nice cover. <laughs> yeah, we have costumes for everything, even phones. Nope, those are for display purposes only. All we've got left is this. You know what? I'll take it. And the bunny suit. Hey! For Grim! For Grim. Can you at least deliver this peace offering to Big Bo for me? <laughs> If I can't go through security, I'll go under it. No one knows these grounds like old Spike. <laughs> Cooler than a cucumber and sharper than a cactus, Zero runs his number because he likes to practice. So let's go, Big Bo. Good luck for the game. Thanks, Klaus. Oh, hey, where's the fruit come from? Huh? If it wasn't you, then... The cauldron is haunted! Hmm. Dawson. A simple thank you would suffice. What do you want, Spike? I want you to understand how important this game is to Grim. Grim wants nothing to do with you. Oh, that'll change when I tell everyone your secret. What secret? Ever since you injured your wrist a few years well, ago. Uh, I'm sure Klaus doesn't want to hear about that. My secret. And soon, so will everyone in the Super League. What? I'm gonna post it on Natter. Fine. What do you want me to do? I'm gonna take you on a little tour. At the end, there'll be a question. Get it right, and I'll cancel the post. <sighs> Where do we start? Pull on the candle holder. Oh. Um... Not that one. Whoa! Big bow? <gasps> Big Bo is a ghost? It's time for the real Grim Tour. Right. First up, calling the stadium the cauldron. That was my idea. And eating all those ice lollies? Also your idea. Maybe. Next up is the famous ghost train. My idea. And finally, Grim FC's legendary showmanship. Your idea. My idea! <laughs> Grim has tried to erase my legacy, but you can't rewrite history! So, who's responsible for making Grim the club it is today? Um, Neville? Careful now, Big Bo. All right, it's Spike Dawson. You bet your life it's Spike Dawson! So, are we done? Oh, there will be two more lessons. Answer the banana within three rings, or the post goes live! Wait, how do I get out of here? Oh. Huh? Hmm, back at the Hall of Heroes. Third striker coming through! Yeah, the three-striker formation is rocking, dudes. Well, it's easy when there's no one to stop the ball. Klaus, huh? where's Big Bo? I don't know, Coach. He disappeared, just like a girl. Sorry I'm late, Coach. I got a little lost. All right, well, let's get on with it. Yes, the 
three striker formation is working great. It's not our fault we've got the best goalie in the Super League. Yeah, as long as he doesn't disappear again. Uh huh? Huh? Big bow. The guy could stop a freight train. He could catch an aeroplane. Isn't uh, that... Uh, 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 get back, ghost of shakes! It's me, dude. Big Bo's gone missing. Again. Step onto the plate, Big Bo. The skull stone? Huh? Come on, Spike. If you want to play footy, just ask. Oh, we're playing. A game called What It Feels Like to Be Spike. Uh, Weighed down by the burden of unrealized talent, I couldn't move forward. Instead, I spent my time watching and re-watching every game you played. I noticed something everyone else missed. How good I look in tights? Your weakness! In five minutes, that cannon will fire. Save the goal, or I release your secret. <gasps> and if I can't lift the stone? Then you'll stay down there and be forgotten. Just like they forgot old Spike. Guess this means you post my secret on Natter. Not if you've learned your lesson. Whose career did you destroy? Oh. Say it! Spike Dawson. Correct. All right, what's my final challenge? Oh, I'm saving that for tomorrow. But tomorrow's the game! <laughs> So, you think Big Bo is a ghost? I know he's a ghost! But he is alive, yes? How'd he suddenly become a ghost? Maybe he was touched by another ghost! I don't think that's how ghosts work. You're thinking of vampires, Klaus! And werewolves. And zombies. You're telling me those monsters can make other monsters, but ghosts can't make other ghosts? Enough it is. There's no such thing as go- Ghost! <laughs> He's not a ghost. We were worried about you, brother. Yeah, where have you been? And why are you wet? You sure you want to know? Of course, Come dude. on, try us. Oh. A few years ago, I injured my wrist against the upright. It wasn't long before I was back in goal, but Spike had made it his mission to watch my every move. And eventually, he figured out my weakness. What weakness? Yeah, you are the best. Whenever I dive low to my left, I hesitate. About one in three shots goes in. <laughs> now, unless I do what Spike says, he'll put my secret out on Natter. You'll be a soft target for the Grim Strikers tomorrow. We'll be lucky if the scoreline is only 2-0. That's scarier than you being a ghost, Big Bo. Hey, we're always counting on you, Big Bo. But tomorrow, you can count on us. Yeah, we'll score a bunch of goals. Let's do it. Yeah. We got you, Big That'll Bo. That'll take the pressure off. Yeah. Give me a beat. Nope. Match night at the Cauldron. As usual, the Grim fans have really got into the spirit of the occasion. And so have the commentators. Right, Mac? Well, I hate to be all done, Brenda. Too late. Ah! <laughs> <gasps> hmm. <laughs> Guys, footy isn't about how you look. It's about how I look. <laughs> <laughs> if you see this man, report it to security. Spike Dawson. That weirdo. Some guys just don't know when to quit. Tonight, Veratuvia is like a ghost town. Because everyone's at the cauldron. Yeah, everyone except me. Thanks for nothing, Belmont. Wow. Those masks are getting pretty good. Huh. 
gone to the game. Duh. <laughs> a little rude. <laughs> yes. Perfect. The first half draws to a close as Super Strikers turn up the heat. But the home team stays cool under pressure. At this stage, uh. it's anyone's game. <laughs> Come on! We got a score for Big Bo! Let's do it! Me first! Okay, fine. Then me second! Come on, take a mask. That's it. Look at me. Huh? I'm the guy who almost ruined Grim. Free? I wouldn't wear one if you paid me. Dawson is the worst. I need to get in there. Finally. It's my turn! Oh, and it's Grim on the counter! With Super Strikers bullfitting that attack, they've left gaps in the midfield! Yeah. Grim closes in on Big Bo! Oh, oh, Grim! What's the last lesson, Spike? Identify my rightful place in Grimm, and you'll get to cancel the post yourself. Hmm, Spike's rightful place. My last challenge is at the castle. But we got you covered, brother. Spike has left me no choice. You won't make it back in time. I know a shortcut. Hey, yo, what do you know? My ruby is the best, and his name is Big... Huh? 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 Hey, you can't go in there! I said you can't! Where did they go? That's freaky. <laughs> you hear that? Maybe the cauldron is haunted. <laughs> Oh, Spike, your rightful place, huh? Don't do it, Big Bo! Shakes? I know it's gonna give Grimm an advantage, but it's not worth letting Spike control you like this. You can cancel this post, but how will you stop the next one? Or the next? It's another post from Spike Dawson. And if he's right, Big Bo has a weakness to his bottom left. <gasps> Where are they? We can't do this without them. <laughs> How do you keep doing that? Spike was right. One and three goes in. Four Spike. Four Spike. And the fans show their appreciation. There he is. Spike. Four Spike. Cool man. All right. Give me yeah. one. Looks pretty good. Look at this. <laughs> Finally, I'm getting the recognition I deserve. Hey, I'm real happy for you, buddy. But you're standing on my foot. <laughs> Sorry. Excuse me. Grim is really hammering Big Bo's weak spot. And it's another save. That's two. Will the next one be a goal? <laughs> Super Spikers defenders can see the corner. Belmont is waving his whole team forward. He really wants to reverse the historic scoreline and win 2-0. My room is kind of gloomy and sort of acting like a ghost, but I know he'll always be there when his team needs him the most. Don't bother, Klaus. All I've done is let a goal in. I'm not cheering because you never let a goal in. I cheer because to do our best, we need to focus on our strengths, not what holds us back. Besides, your roomies. 
but at least you're sick. I hesitate. Your weakness. One in three shots goes in. <laughs> One big ball. Epic save, dude. Oh, me! Awkward! Big bow defies the odds. And it's a massive goal kick. Can his teammates okay. deliver on the opposite end? <laughs> yes, they can! <laughs> Give me a B! B. Find him. It's like trying to find a needle in a stack of needles. This sucks. A draw? Spike Dawson's theory's done nothing for Grim. For Grim. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, please. You can kick me out, but I'll be back. You will see. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, the skull stone is where it belongs. That's not the only thing that's where it belongs. I guess we pulled it off, Big Bo. I gotta admit, Klaus, you're a pretty awesome roommate. That's very supportive. Could you try it in chant form? I'll help you. It's Klaus, Klaus, MC in the house. Really? You're all ghosts now? I guess this place isn't haunted. Huh? <laughs>